Hi, um, I'm here in Milan at the fifth uh, EHPA European Heat Pump Forum talking to uh, Karl Oxner, who is the president of EHPA. Uh, welcome, Karl. Many thanks for agreeing to answer my questions. First of all, what is EHPA? EHPA is the Association of the European Heat Pump Industry. And what is it that you work to do at EHPA? What are your main goals? Well, we think that we should make heat pumps the preferred heating technology in Europe. Heat pumps is a proven technology, energy efficient and cost efficient. Now, the EHPA has grown really quite remarkably over the last years from a, an association of some 30 members to now close to 100. Can you tell us a little bit about that journey? Yes, um, seven years ago we have been only 32 members and then we focused on uh, monitoring in Brussels the Commission energy policy and I think this is such an important task for the members that we got new and new and more and more members. Now we are almost 100. Mr. Oxner, can you explain to us just in very simple terms what is a heat pump actually and why is it that this is uh, um, a good energy mode for the future? The problem is that you, it's not so easy to explain how a heat pump works, but I will try. Heat pump is an energy efficient machine, an energy efficient technology. It can make much more of one kilowatt hour electricity than other technologies. Number two, heat pumps is a renewable technology because they can use ambient heat. Ambient heat is air everywhere, in the open air, in ground, in the groundwater and can take this heat from the ambient and raise it to a higher level of temperature being useful for heating or lowering, lowering the temperature being useful for cooling. If we look a few years ahead uh, to 2020, what then is your outlook for the European heat pump industry? I think that um, heat pump technology and ambient heat will after all take the major part to solve our energy problems of the future.